Hello video creators. Welcome to HitPaw channel. In recent years, AI technology has developed rapidly in art areas. AI writing, AI painting, even AI composing are already in progress. In this video we will introduce some text to image AI tools to show you guys how to use them. Hope this video can help you get more inspirations in painting with AI tools. The first tool is Disco Diffusion. It is designed by artist Somni. The tool has powerful keyword to image ability. The code is based online, so we can process the rendering online without worrying about the calculation ability of the computer. This is the look of the website. You can find the link in the description. It is full of code. But no worries, we only need to change some settings to get the result. Firstly, scroll down and find the settings. We can set up the metrics in the right side. The step means the number of iteration. The bigger it is, the more detailed the image. The default is 250, we will leave it as default. The width height is the resolution of the image. Only multiples of 64 is available. It takes more time to render if the resolution is big. We will just leave it as default. The init image allows you to upload a reference image. The AI will do the rendering based on the reference image. We can upload the reference image from our local files to the website. Then right-click to copy the path. And paste it here, and that's it. Next, scroll down to the settings. In the text prompts, we can see the original description as a beautiful painting of a singular lighthouse, shining its light across a tumultuous sea of blood by Greg Rutkowski and Thomas Kincaid, trending on art station, yellow color scheme. This is the description of the image which we'd like the AI to create for us. To change the image, we can edit the description to what we want. Here, beautiful painting is the painting style, let's make it comic. A singular lighthouse, shinning its light across a tumultuous sea of blood as the content description, let's improvise something like a cyberpunk city, must be cool. Greg Rutkowski and Thomas Kincaid as the style of painter, we can add more than one painter, like Picasso and Van Gogh. Trending on ArtStation as the reference platform, such as Facebook, Pixiv. The AI will get references from the platform. Yellow color scheme is the main color tone of the image, we will change it to dark blue to match with the cyberpunk color. Moving on to the diffuse settings. In the end batches, we can set how many images to create. If we change it to 10, then the AI will generate 10 images based on what we just set. And of course the more time it will cost. Finally, we need to run the codes. The website will ask you to log in the Google Drive. If you don't have one, just create one and log in. Then the generated images will be saved in your Google Drive files. For free users, the rendering process will usually be assigned to a computer with Tesla K80 graphic card. So usually it takes 3 to 4 hours to generate 10 photos with default resolution. For VIP users, the speed will be faster. Now we can scroll down to the diffuse settings, and waiting for the process. We can preview the iteration here. The final images will be saved in Google Drive files. We can download them from there. Oh. 
Okay then, let's skip the long process and look at the result directly. First glance, blue tone, scientific cyberpunk city, giant, comic style, with a little Picasso and Van Gogh style, in an art form. Basically the AI generates all the content we required. Not bad, isn't it? Except that the elements in these images are almost the same, just in different positions and different sizes. This could have more space to play around. Anyway, Disco Diffusion has many parameters to customize. It is an impressive tool for artists to get inspired when designing. The next tool is DALE2. It is a program of OpenAI. The AI system can create realistic images and art from a description in natural language. There are many image examples in their website, like an astronaut riding a horse in a photorealistic style. Or it can add and remove elements while taking shadows, reflections and textures into account. Really impressive work. However, DALE 2 is still a research project. Only a group of users who has been selected can use it. The OpenAI team also plans to invite more people to preview the research over time. If you are interested in the project, you may go to their website and join DALE 2 preview waitlist. Although DALE 2 isn't available for most people, a tool called DALE Mini is available online. It is also an AI model that generates images from any prompt you give. We can type in any descriptions we like. Let's say a cyberpunk city with flying cars in the sky in photorealistic style. Then click Run. Within seconds, the AI generates nine photos for us. We can click to preview the images. They look blurry because of the low resolution. We can right click to save the image. The image size is low, this tool couldn't generate high res images. It is more like giving artists an atmosphere for designing. The image quality of DALE Mini is definitely not matchable with Disco Diffusion and DALE 2. However, it is much faster for artists to imagine. Another tool is called Wombo Dream. It can create high-quality artwork in seconds. It is mainly designed for mobile users, so the ratio of the image is set to fit with mobile devices. You may get the app on both iOS and Android devices. We can also use the online version. Click Start Creating. The tool can only support entering prompt within 100 letters. Let's say a cyberpunk city with flying cars in the sky again. Then choose an art style we like. Only within seconds, the image has been generated. It looks really artistic. We can click save to save it to local file. It can only create one image each time, but we can click generate more to get more images. The tool is really good at creating a sense of art painting, really cool. If you don't like the ratio of Wombo Dream, and Disco Diffusion is too difficult for you, Night Cafe Creator might be another choice to try. It is more easier. In the main page, we can type in the description of the image, let's say Cyberpunk Dragon. Then choose a style, similar to Wombo Dream. Here we would recommend click more options. and turn on advanced options.
you can choose artistic or coherent algorithm to run. Next, you can choose multiple images to start with, even change the aspect ratio. Or generate a video with zooming, panning and runtime and output resolution. After setting up, click Create to generate the image. The tool offers 5 credits for free. It charges when you want to create more images. Alright, these AI tools are all online based. They all have different advantages. You may choose the one that suits you most. Some people are also worried about AI taking the place of artists. Personally, we don't think that AI can actually replace our creation. AI just provides us a new way to inspire our imagination. What matters is how we use AI to better improve our creation. Hope this video helps. And we would really appreciate it if you can hit the subscribe button. This will be a great help for the channel. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned and see you next time.